Hello, everybody. Welcome back to uh, Bros for Hoes. We are playing Gears of War, and we're going to do some more boating. So, uh, the, uh, what's this song that Jack sings when he ends up in Christmas Town? I took that and revamped the lyrics for Thor because the whole time he's he's like watching us. That recliner he, that was there, he loved that. He lay in that all the time. And and we're putting up this Christmas tree, so I wrote I rewrote the song referencing like what was going on the whole time the Christmas tree is getting put up and shit like that. And I had a lot of fun doing it. Um, so talking about like the chair being taken away and what the fuck are you doing and oh my god this is a tree I love this. <laughs> Bye guys, nice knowing ya. I'm gonna go over here and collect shit. Perfect. I feel they just explode. No fucking shit, shirt. Get the fuck out of my way, Dom. <laughs> Asshole. And they just killed the guys at checkpoint one. Shit. All right, yo, Santiago, man. Shh. Fucking get Stop. your thumb out of your ear, and your dick out of your ass, your balls out of your throats. Don't mind if I do. They really want you to be full, don't they? Yeah, they do. That's a lot of ammo. I literally picked up a gigantic ammo case for two fucking snipper rounds. Don't run away from your feelings! I'll tell you what, that was the hardest thing to watch for me. Or one of the hardest things to watch for me in gaming was when Dom sacrificed himself. That hurt. Like, when I was, I was yeah. playing that with Adam when that happened. And we were planning on, like, gaming to beat it that night. We both hit that and we're like, I think we're done for the night. Yeah, that that hurt a lot. Oh, yeah. God, I love a sniper rifle. Did you get him? Yeah, but I hit oh, him. Oh, Shoulder. Wow, that's just not not doing it. All right, asshole. Show me your head. <laughs> Double team, bitch. <laughs> Really? Watch out. Fuck! Tits! Ass! Oh, I... Yeah, that that's... Did you blow me up? Yes, I did. You're an asshole! <laughs> Let's turn the light on. Hey. Shoot every propane tank you see from now on. We need Go fuck life. yourself. People out here aren't gonna like that one. Just, we use that shit. It's either that or they I love how they're strategically placed for us. It's like they knew we were coming. Oh... Oh shit, all over your tits. Oh yeah. My favorite place. Chain gun down. Ugh. Just eat shit and die. I don't know who got him. You did, because I didn't have a chance to pull the trigger. <laughs> like, I was aiming, and then his head disappeared. <laughs> we'll move the I thought you shot, too. Fuck you, Curl. <laughs> Fuck your couch. I have no idea what that means, but apparently it's a slang saying. Ah, tits. I don't know, I just like yelling at from... So I watched the shit out of Chappelle show back when That's that came out. That's where that came from? I don't get it. Explain to me the reference. Yeah, he was doing a skit where he was Rick James. Just fucked up on drugs all the time. And he came into one of the guy's house with dirty ass shoes and just got on his couch and started grinding his feet into it. Just like, fuck your couch. And it's like, buy another one, you rich motherfucker. Well, I wonder if I can hit it from here. I've done that before. No, I haven't. Wow. One of us has. Oh, we're doing that. <laughs> Holy shit, I think I got it. <laughs> you might have gotten it, I think. Damn, I, I've never done that before, so if, if we've done it before, it was you, that's for sure. Oh, no, I missed. I would throw one in there. Is that actually the emergence hole? Yep. Yeah, it is. Did you just... Oh. 
You shot me. Now I shot your dick off. Wait, why are you hitting me? I'm not. It won't let me. Nope. All the nope. Up in the nope train to fuck that bill. Oh, God! Jesus! Did you just, like, spawn out of nowhere? What he the fuck? He wasn't there when I came through. He, no. No, he wasn't. Kriker! Kriker! Hey, hold on a sec. Hold on a sec. Hold on a sec. Zug Zug? Sub Zug. Whoa. Ooh. Quit poking me. Come on, dipstick. I love getting, like, this super bullet from the reload. Mm -hmm. And then just kneecapping him. Because that'll kill him in one fucking I didn't shot. even have a super bullet. I still kneecapped him. Nice shot, Tex. Shit, yeah, Shit, yeah motherfucker! Well, fuck your couch! Are you sitting for ammo? I'm yeah, taking it. Pretty good. Oh, where'd his head go? It disappeared. There's a box up here too, around the down the hallway into the right. Don't go into any of the rooms. It's pitch black. No way we can get through. Oh hell yeah! Frag grenades. There, he's still there. Hey man, it's cold. Bears in the toilet. Listen. I love this guy's voice. They're bringing out the big guns. Something's about to go down for sure. Pick you up as soon as. I would love to have like Morgan Freeman narrate my life. <laughs> I think everybody would. Mm -hmm. And then Derek took out his dick and proceeded to masturbate. For three hours. His penis looked like a plate of sushi when he was done. He then proceeded to play The Witcher 3, at which point he saw Triss and took out his penis again. <laughs> ah, fuck! Got there were people here. Should have guessed. Nice shot. Only one less. Two less. Tits! Oh, fuck. Fuck, fuck, tits. Fuck oh, shit. Tits. Is this in the dark, too? Ah, oh, shit. Let's see if I can get well, that. Oh, I hole. just turned the light on. I'll get your hole. Damn it, I missed. Ooh, I got it. I know I got it. That yes, was the got it dust. noise. Really? Fuck! God damn it! Twat knocker! Oh shit. Hi. Damn it, Bill! <laughs> Ass clown! <laughs> we both keep going for the same we one. We also both fucked up the reload. <laughs> Fuck! We both missed that one. Fuck! I hate you! Dying of fire. <laughs> I'll get this one. Oh shit! I wouldn't. Wouldn't do that. That's really ballsy. <sighs> oh tits! That was dumb. You got it. Um. Fuck. What were we talking about? <laughs> I don't remember. Oh, right, Morgan Freeman narrating my Oh, yeah, that's that's where we were. Stark everywhere. Stay here. Side with that light. There, give me an update. But yeah, that, that's what happens a lot. I I fucking like so you, you get into the Witcher lore and you get into the Witcher community, um a lot of people don't like Triss and they wrote like Triss is actually kind of a cunt. In the she actually she is a cunt in the books it sounds like um, Yennefer's a bitch. Uh, I kind of want to reread but, those. You've read the Witcher books? I've read the first one. There's a new one coming out in a couple weeks. Which the first I think the first one was just like a collection of stories based on the Witcher, on Geralt. Geralt. Marcus. Geralt. Geralt of Rivia. But but anyways the I've only ever played the games and in the first one Triss is kind of a cunt. Um, in the second one, it feels like they really rewrote her character. Like, she, I felt like I had more sympathy for her, cared a lot more for her. She didn't feel 
shouldn't feel manipulative at all, to be honest. Um, and in the third one, even more so, she feels very genuine and honest and caring. Like she actually, I feel like she actually genuinely cares for girl, but a lot of the community hates her thinking, and, and fair enough, like she's shit in the books. But Yennefer's such a dick to Geralt all the time. She's fucking <laughs> snarky and she's not, really, she's just, she's a, she's a bitch. Um, but I also have a thing for redheads, which doesn't help. Um, yeah, I know how you feel on that one. Yeah, so I do legitimately, like I, I've romanced her in every game I've played. Um, and I, I really, really, like, her character is really great in... Um, I say I have a thing for redheads yet. Three. I married a blonde. I married a brunette. Um, but yeah, I I really like her character. I think in three she's got a lot of depth and and, and caring, and she's not just trying to manipulate Geralt anymore, which I thought was really. Like I said, I feel like they really changed her character a bit for the games. Damn it, I missed, didn't I? Oh, you're an asshole! Fine. Do it the old-fashioned way. Oh, wow, he just, he just, he's, he's just, he's just dead. He didn't kill you. Let's do this. Um, because what's funny is, in 3, the reason I actually really like her so much is if she ever was manipulative girl, she actually, I almost feel like it's really, really, really hidden deep beneath. But that she actually really started to care for Geralt, and so she let him go, knowing that he may not have been there of his own volition. But then there's also the possibility that, um, your relationship with Yennefer had everything to do with a gin wish. So... Um... Uh, I don't know. I just thought at least Triss treated you a lot more, a lot better. And, well, and the other thing, so to spoil the ending of Witcher 3, um, depending, and, and uh, to, let me rephrase it, to spoil a ending for Witcher 3 and, and only a piece of that, if you choose to romance Triss and get the good ending, um, you move way north, she ends up as, a, as an advisor for a king, and you kind of just, she, you don't need money, so you more so take Witcher contracts just to keep your Sense is sharp and just have a little bit of coin. You, you, like, you don't need money. Right. And I honestly feel like that is more Geralt. If you yeah, romance Yennefer, sense. you actually completely retire and, like, it says you sleep till noon every day and just do fuck all. I don't feel like that's Geralt. I no. feel like he would all. He. I legitimately I feel, feel like he would keep up with his training till he died. I feel like not only that, but I also feel like he cares about the populace enough. And, and, yeah. and some of that is, is indicative on the choice that you make in the game. So let me rephrase. The girl that I play cares about the people to the point where I never... So in 3, you actually a lot of times have the option to haggle over price of a contract. You know, side quest. Box here side quest contract. Um, yeah, I should take that. Well, how are you sitting? Uh, full. Okay. Um, anyways, and, and so that's why I just feel that ending more fits my personal narrative. I fucking love Siri. She is so much fun to play as. She, uh, she's a child of the Elder Blood, and she can teleport. It's so fucking cool. <laughs> kind of like playing. Ah, fuck. Kind of like playing Deadpool. I love Deadpool. Fuck your couch. I should bring over Chappelle Show and make you watch it. Oh, why did I do that? I actually fired at them. Ah, oh, and then I fucked it up. Oh shit, run. Yeah, we gotta keep up with this one. I mean, it looks like we need to keep up with this car because it's going on its own. Not that this isn't the dozenth time we've done it. No, never. But actually, this would probably be a good place to cut it. We will see you guys next time on Rose of Horrors, where we talk about more hot redheads. And I came. <laughs>